ben suda mom vote na be pare mo ngi nonu andak jabaram ñu ngi sol white white wara wax ak taskat xibaar ñu ngi nonu di prepare legi teer gi inshallah ñu deglu ko lan lay wax ban yaakar la am ndax xalam dalna ak mel nonu xamna usually lo len de wax ñu deglu ko bu ko defé ñu fatale tamit yenen candidate si ku melni comme bakari badji ñom tamit nañ ko deglu pa modu mom sandina be pare mom tamit wax na kaddu am ci kadam tuti ni good morning to all of you good morning to all gambians and all km residents Yes, uh, I'm very happy to have casted my vote uh, with my wife, uh, Salima Tujalo Bensuda. And uh, just like the consular election, I think the turnout is similar. I've said it before, uh, presidential elections always have the highest turnout, the national assembly elections, the local government elections. We expect that the turnout will be better than consular elections, but we don't expect it to be at the level of the presidential elections, which is quite a uh, norm as far as Uh, historical evidence is concerned. Uh, however, I always like to emphasize that local governance, as far as I am concerned, is the most important part of governance because the councillor and the mayor are the closest to the community. They are the uh, uh, government officials that are elected at the community level and the development they bring is high impact at a community level. So I believe all Gambians should take an interest and come out in their large numbers and vote for their candidates of choice. Candidate of choice. Lord Mayor, um, when you um, were nominated, you were confident that you were going to win. Today is the D-Day. Um, how confident? I was confident before nomination. I am confident after nomination. Uh, of course, the councillor election is already um, a sample of the feeling of com the community of KM how they feel towards the council, my leadership and the councillors. So we are still confident that we will uh, win this election uh, come 5 o'clock p.m. today. Uh, Mayor, Sepras projected you as a winner with uh, 55%. And some of your uh, supporters on social media are saying that you're going to have 60% or more. Um, what are your you know, target areas when it comes to percentage of winning this election? Well, Sepras has never missed uh, presidential. They were very close. Um, in parliamentary, they were very close. I think in this survey, my win was predict predicted to be the most decisive, uh, meaning over 50%. Um, if people guess that it may be 60%, uh, that may be correct according to the survey because there's a lot of undecideds as well. I believe based on the survey results, 17%. But um, I'm not one to be taken away by service. What I'm confident about is people have confidence in the uh, service we have rendered over the years. And we have done it in a very impartial way. We have tried to be a uh, uniting force for all Gambians, regardless of political affiliation, tribe, etc. We want a Gambia for Gambians, and we want all Gambians to see themselves in our leadership. During the councillor's election, you said the councillor's election would have an impact on the mayoral election, whether positively or negatively. Now, today is the D-Day for the mayoral election. Do you maintain the same statement after your party won the majority in your council? Of course, uh, my statement was not political at all. It was based on law. Uh, if you look at the Local Government Act, the council is the executive, not the mayor. The council, the body of councillors are the ones that make a decision on how council should operate, whether be it procurement, employment, budgeting, etc. So the mayor, um, I said it in the Bakao rally, is more of the icing on the cake, but it's not the cake. Uh, the mayor sets the agenda, the mayor sets the vision, but the councillors make the decision via vote. So if you have a majority in council, uh, in your political party, of course it's easy to bring your agenda on the table and have it approved right away, and vice versa. So um, in the council election, you interviewed me here, I told you, I said, uh, if the uh, UDP has majority in council, which we do now, and it's actually a super majority, because the first time we had 12, now we have 15, uh, the mandate of the council is already decided. And to make a correction, uh, nominated councillors cannot vote. Nominated councillors can only advocate for their constituents but the voting is with the elected uh, councillors. So I'd like to make that clarification. I would also like to make a clarification that a mayor is not an executive. A mayor has no executive power. Uh, a mayor only has uh, 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 the power to lead. But the decision, like I said, always comes down to a vote, which the mayor never partakes. Thank you very much, Lord. Local language. 
ignore_time_segment_in_scoring Nyingi Hankov, I swing monitoring officers of our party. New Dorland, Sibir, Majum Estate, Sibopam. Then New Hanlen over to PIU. Tegu mane ken amna dole Sibir dekabi for deflo lo moromam. Police amu dole bobo. Saka tu ma civilian. Then nyingi am report ne ga nyingi am I teza I tia gas nyingi tia gas swing PR officer bi. Nyingi teza I individual. And this is the second incident. Et ce qu'il a dit, le président de l'État de l'État, c'est qu'il a fait un buffer zone et qu'il a fait un buffer zone. Il faut savoir qu'il a fait un buffer zone pour qu'il a fait un buffer zone pour qu'il a fait un buffer zone. Et aujourd'hui, je veux dire que c'est ça. Ce qu'on a dit, c'est qu'on a fait un buffer zone. Si on a fait un buffer zone politique, on a fait un buffer zone pour qu'on a fait un buffer zone. Si on a fait un buffer zone, 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 et vice versa. Parce qu'on a fait un buffer zone, c'est qu'on a fait un buffer zone. So nain try nyu jamal nanti politik mom halat yu utai larek, nanti jarut heh jarut hecho. Tapi jika di jabar nyingi deka bena ker nyingi support different party. Kom football team rek, kom nyung lendi halal ni. Koko mai mayor Talib Ben Suda mungkin wahlu am solo. Wai deng buka dem cross dem banjul street. Tapi deglu nji tiri omi president baru mom tapi deka nyu san nji kerja. Kam ham gen nyu ingkoi deka nyu cross cross dem different areas. Deng nyu wat cikat bu inga ham antena mom mayor mungkin wahat. Pas kelum dong wasa deka 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 halal linga ham antena jalan leral. Tapi deka dong lu dua war cium nyu kawah lo lu tapi ham nadi film kotak akli tam wako tas kadi hebar ham nadi nyu kolaj. But legi legi deng nyu wara dem banjul deglu president baru. Of course nyu fatale tapi amna yen Kandidat singa haman tene nelayan degar cikanam kumil ni kom KMC nen fanyuat bakar baji ak kenga haman tene momoi pamo dumbo banjul temit rohi malik lo ak ibu fay bot ni deglu presiden baru mungkin ono banjul suka defe wah legi negi nyu muara tambali wah wah mungkin ono ketak sari hibari parenai nyu kita haw mom temit andak nyari soh nami nyu kita haw wara wahak linga haman tene moy tas kari hibari gis ngenen lolo nyu ki nyu ki kita haw right now gana bum vote pros Proses bini lah, ban ya karla am ag new deglu ko mungkin orang dewa presiden baru. For the good job they are doing for the Gambian people, I think it's a national duty.